I am Maria Brown, the Head of Research and Education at MRG. Many organizations are having conversations about the need for diversity, equity, and inclusion in the workplace. We agree with the importance of DEI and believe that this is an essential part of leadership development. To help coaches work with leaders who want to become more effective in these areas, MRG developed a DEI questionnaire. This questionnaire can be added to the LEA Self and LEA 360 assessments. MRG's approach to questionnaire development has always been data-driven, and this was no exception. The questionnaire design process began in 2020 with an extensive review of the literature that allowed us to define our constructs and create some potential items. So here's what we wanted to measure within each area or construct. For diversity, we were interested in measuring how effective leaders were at addressing discrimination, learning about people as individuals rather than as members of a group, and mitigating the effects of unconscious bias. For equity, we were interested in effectiveness uh, at being fair and consistent. And finally, for inclusion, we wanted to measure how effective leaders were at ensuring that everyone feels that they belong and can contribute and that those contributions are welcome. We started with over 100 items. And after much discussion, that list was reduced to 28 items. To reduce the item count, we considered several things. First, we limited it to aspects of DEI that are relevant in a leadership context, because this was going to be part of the LEA, the Leadership Effectiveness Analysis. We also wanted to make sure that we looked at diversity broadly. Diversity comes in many forms, so we wanted to include items that could apply to any type or any form of diversity, not just race, not just gender, not just age, and so on, but any form of diversity. Finally, we wanted to reduce redundancy while still measuring a variety of factors. So we allowed some similarity um, between items to find the best way to ask questions and measure, uh, measure effectiveness, uh, but we limited uh, how, how redundant the items were. This led to a 28 item questionnaire that we launched in 2021 as a beta version of the DEI questionnaire. Data collected during the beta phase were used to evaluate and update the questionnaire further. So in this phase of the questionnaire development process, we determined which items best align with the areas of diversity, equity, and inclusion by conducting a factor analysis and by determining how items correlated with relevant measures in the LEA leadership impact questionnaire. With actual data, we were able to eliminate the redundant items while still ensuring that we measured each construct fully. The end result is a nine item questionnaire that provides useful feedback on a broad set of areas in DEI. We will continue to evaluate the questionnaire, especially as we add new languages and start making those available. Now let's look at the questionnaire. Uh, as you can see here, there are three items measuring each of the three areas of interest, three for diversity, three for equity, and three for inclusion. The list on the screen includes all observer items. Self items ask about the same set of skills, but the framing is different. So the first item in the self questionnaire reads, as a leader, I take quick and appropriate action to address any form of disrespect or discrimination. In the observer questionnaire, as you can see here, the item begins with this leader takes quick and appropriate action and so on. By asking both self and observers to rate leaders in these areas, leaders have the opportunity to reflect on their effectiveness and then compare their self-perceptions to what they are conveying to others. This is an important first step to increasing self-awareness and setting the stage for development.